Good afternoon friends and welcome back to our channel. My name is Nirjang Lama and today we'll be talking about a small little confusion that most of us have between two courses which is the PCA and the BTEC. I'm sure most of us would have had their ears raised up after you listened to this thing. But my request is, if you like to get the confusion cleared, please stay with us till the end of the video. All right? Uh, let's start off with, with the basic components of this tool course. The BCA actually means Bachelor of Computer Application and the BTEC is a Bachelor of Technology. Now the difference between these two courses is that the BCA looks purely on computer applications whereas the BTEC is more of an engineering based degree which looks into various facets of the engineering uh, uh, specializations, right? So now, now the question that most of us have is maybe you might have heard that uh, probably the BTEC is uh, a better option than the BCA. Now let's think about that. Let me repeat the question. Is the BTEC better than the BCA? My answer to that would be a very big no. And the next question is, would be a BCA better than a BTEC? And the answer would still be the same, which is a big fat no. These two courses are completely wonderful, beautiful in their own ways and setup that they are made and devised by specific universities. Yes, there are certain differences between these two courses and, and that's what we're trying to discuss in today's video. Number one is that the BCA course is for three years, right? And the BTEC course will take you for a journey of four years. So it takes about four years to finish a BTEC program, whereas you finish a BCA in about just three years time. Now, there are certain advantages also, if you look at it, is that uh, if I am doing a BTEC course and somebody else is doing a BCA, then that person or that guy has a one year advantage over me, which means when I finish my BTEC degree, that the person with a BCA would have at least one year extra uh, experience uh, over what I would have. Next is, uh, the BTEC guy would be mostly uh, mostly engineering prone sort of an individual whereas uh, the BCA guy internationally would be regarded and is regarded as a technocrat. Now if this word technocrat is ringing some bells in your head then let me explain to you a little bit on the word technocrat. It actually means that a BCA guy is a technocrat so he will have two set of skills which is he will be very good with the technology of computers and at the same time he'll also be trained and equipped with the knowledge to run manage a business so that's why you are a technical guy with some autocratic skills as well right and uh, in other ways there are some differences in terms of, of, of uh, jobs yes the other thing that might come to your mind is uh, what am I what are my future in this? What is my future? Will I get a good job? Will I be placed internationally? Whereas boys and girls, uh, you will know that, uh, you'll be quite happy to actually know that in BCA, the job options are equally same, right? For what a BTEC graduate also gets. The salary is also more or less the same. And I don't want you to just look at, inter at, at a national level. You'll have to look more outer than the national level. You have to see from international perspectives different countries and and and, and it's a, it's a pride actually to do a degree in our own country because we we actually have a lot of Indians working all over the country uh, bigger pardon all over the world uh, with our own degrees and and we are doing fantastic jobs across now uh, if if this is getting a bit too technical and if you still want to know like how would these two courses be different so let me just explain to you in a very simple word all right now if you are interested in manufacturing or creating a button a button all right if you like to manufacture a button then you could probably take up a BTEC course but if you'd like to know that what can the press of a button do and the wonders that it can create then you should be in a BCA program. So boys and girls and friends, uh, what, is, what I'm trying to say here is the, the doctors and, uh, and, and the plastic surgeons and, and also uh, 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 and the cosmetic people, they, what they do is uh, they will create a beautiful face, the, the engineers would create a great book and you, a BCA graduate, you take that face and you take the book and you create something great as a Facebook. That's what you got to do here because you are a technocrat. But before this, if your confusion is still very deep, we would suggest that you take a deep breath, right? 
do a self-introspection and try to figure out what are your basic skills? What is that you really, really would like to do? Think about it, think deep, dig deep into yourself and trust me, you will get the answers. And if it's still not helping you, then get back to us and we'll be more than happy to help you, to guide you and to support you. Well, thank you friends and thank you very much for watching our video. And uh, if you'd like to get more information on this, and, and, and similar kind of videos from Inspira Knowledge Campus, I would please, uh, I would request you to please uh, subscribe to our channel, something red color down there, please click on that, and then you'll be updated with all kind of wonderful, exciting videos that we have to present to you. Thank you very much.